Hello and welcome back with Lady Rebecca Blinko. So uh, really quick, just want to share that I am going to be baking biscuits. I have done them in the past, but I have it all in one bowl. But this is just the beginning because it's all the dry ingredients. The wet ingredients is just half a cup of milk and one egg. And then of course you have four tablespoons of sugar, three cups of flour, and one tablespoon of baking soda, and one and a half, actually a half of another baking soda, uh, and um, salt, okay? So as you can see, I am wearing my Maui cap today, and on November 19th, 2019 is when we decided to go on a trip to Maui. So I am a big support. I am a big support of helping fundraisers. So I did put a link on where you are able to, unless you already have a support and a fundraiser, but I do believe in support with other um, foundations and the the humanitarian as well so but let's get cooking and i would like to um, share and go to the steps on how you are able to create your own biscuits um so let's get to it so stay tuned okay so i'm going to be putting the half of milk okay and then one egg. And of course, don't forget your butter. Okay, so let's get that going. But first we're going to get this. Make sure it's locked. Wanna lock it here on this end. And we'll put it on one. So. You want to make sure your butter is at room temp, so you don't want it to be too cold, but if it is, it's okay. So we're just going to put this in there. So you want to install, you want to put at least three, four cups of butter. Use. Um, measuring spoon or use um, eyeball it and if you need more because of the elevation that you're living at then use more so it's better to use a little more okay and while that is mixing i am going to pour some just slowly so if you're hearing some thunder on the background, it's because we're having a storm. So it's a summer storm right now. So I'm going to use at least half of it because the rest I'm going to split it because I need to use it for the surface so it won't stick. So let's turn it off. Okay. So the dough is pretty fresh because of the butter. So we're just going to make sure that it's mixed well and we are going to mix it again. Okay. 
make sure your mixer is locked and of course you're going to use a flower and this will prevent it from unsticking So if you want to be creative with your biscuit and you want to have a little bit more flavor, you can add olive oil, you can add mint, you can add anything such as rosemary to give it more of that, more flavor to your biscuit. But because I'm making these as a morning biscuits with tea so I'm just gonna have um, very basic but with butter and of course it's optional after they are baked you could also have um, you can spread some um, jam so that's optional as well Okay, so now that this is already stuck, but remember, I do have my extra flour, and this will help from kind of loosen up a little bit of that, the residue. And if you have to use your hands, that's okay, but remember, we're going to have to use that extra flour tray to remember not to use all the flour and if you do then just add extra flour just grab a little bit more and then of course you can't forget this one This will probably give you at least about eight to 10 servings. Maybe 12. And I will show you just in a bit on how I'm going to create How you're able to and I'm doing it really quick because I want to make sure that this is all going to go well Okay, so if you guys saw some thunder, it's because we are having a storm here. So this is really exciting. Give me two thumbs up because I am wearing my Maui baseball cap. Okay. Do you hear the thunder? Okay, so this is a really, really neat. It's not as sticky because I've, uh, I'm already using the flour. Okay, so that's what you want to use. You want to use the extra flour that you have left over. And of course, you're gonna spread it. Kind of knead it here and there, but just be gentle with it because And you don't want it to be so clumped up. And the biscuits are more for, um, you're going to have them on a sheet pan. You don't want to bake it in a cupcake because they're not cupcakes, OK? 
okay? So there's a difference on that. Now, if you want to try it and be curious about it, you can. But they do need to have their space for baking, okay? So now that this is, this is really exciting for me, by the way, okay? So this is just a simple can. I, there's holes that are poked in, okay? So you can have, you can air it out, okay? When you, when you press it down, okay? And you're just going to press, a little, just pour a little bit more and then you're going to press down. And then, voila. Look how beautiful that is. Now, if you wanna scramble an egg, spread it around, and when it bakes, you're going to have the opportunity to cut the center and enjoy your jelly or your jam. However, if you can the jam, that's even better. So this is just one of the impeccables that I have made. So I hope you have enjoyed. I will definitely put down the link on on where you're able to donate for Maui. Thank you for your donations because it goes to the community. Thanks for watching and tune in as they come out. I will definitely take a photo.